three individuals are involved here with a rather impressive travel history. So we have a mom, a daughter, and a son who reach out for guidance. Initially, one of them found uh, something that was uh, described as small, um, dark, about the size of a poppy seed embedded in their skin. Uh, this led to a more involved in investigation where they found that all three of them had similar findings. Uh, some of these uh, were larger, um, some a bit larger. One was actually described as mobile, moving across the belly. Um, there, there were a lot of finger pointing. They, they all seem fine. Uh, they report no skin rashes. Uh, they have a number of concerns about uh, what, what these are. They have ideas about what they think they might be. Um, they also have questions about whether or not these might carry diseases, what to do um, about removing them. Should there be testing, treatment? Now, the interesting travel um, and exposure history. So they report that just prior to this, they had spent a week on a remote island off the northwest coast of Scotland with extensive hiking in tall um, grass and boggy areas with uh, deer, rabbits, and lots of sheep. Apparently, this is an island called Harrison Lewis. And then Saturday, they're hiking in wooded areas around Loch Ness and in the Cairngorms. Um, Sunday, they're out hiking and running on Long Island. And then Wednesday, when these mysterious objects were found, they are now hiking and going for runs in Cape Cod. I mean, these are like jet setters here. So they report on Cape Cod uh, that they were going down this trail and there was a tree that had fallen across the trail. So they actually had to crawl underneath it, which, which got them a little worried. That's what prompted the skin inspection, and that's what led to all these findings. So lots of questions I've got for our listeners here. What might these be, and how do we identify them? Is the travel history relevant? Are there any timing issues that might impact what we do? Should we try to remove these? If we do try to remove these, how? And any testing or treatment indicated.